Hey everybody, welcome back. Skateboard Stories, episode 33, tape number boy. We got the one and only Dylan Gardner. This was on Upper State Street behind a shopping center up there. Pretty sick little spot. bump to ledge not much of a bump there's actually two little bumps right here the one that Dylan's hitting in the beginning here pretty mellow and then there's another one like right there somewhere he just passed it Getting booted out of an alley. <laughs> Skateboarding in 1995. I don't know. They probably still kick people out nowadays. I don't even know. I only skate skate parks. That's a joke. I'm kidding. Yeah, Dylan. What's up? Dylan Gardner, take one. Dylan trying to switch flip one of the pews. There's a little bit of an incline right there. 411 and permeated in all of our brains. Why? Carl doing the theme song. <laughs> Gary Ellsworth. <laughs> He's a tattoo artist uh, nowadays up in San Luis Obispo. And at this time he was running the skate shop. But yeah, there's a little incline there, not much of one. And that bench is huge. <laughs> oh, I can't see myself. Manabu with the super ape. Fuck you. <laughs> Don't smoke kids, it's bad. I quit a long time ago. Fuck you. Shit's Fuck terrible. You. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, Dylan. I was talking with Dylan about this recently, and he has a few sessions throughout these tapes where he's yeah, trying switch flips, or he lands on a few here and there, like remember the one he did over the hydrant a few episodes back, and then he kind of slipped when he went off the curb and fell on his butt. But um, there's this one, I think there's another couple, or we've already maybe watched some other ones, I don't remember, but it's all kind of leading up to the switch flip over the air vent. This was all like, you know, he was trying to take a switch flip to the next level over higher stuff. And eventually he did one over the air vent, which is, you know, damn high, close to waist high. And he's like six foot something. I don't know whose motorcycle that is. Carl's just posting. About to go for a ride. His bike he's sitting on there, Carl. It's my bike. It's your bike? Yeah. I thought it was George and the guys. Pop wheelies on George. 
<laughs> I don't want no peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Brett Hathaway. The Shia. The Shia these days makes music for some of your favorite movies. I'm talking like huge blockbusters. Guardians of the Galaxy type stuff. A new Misfits album today. New one? It's like a, yeah, very, very best album, too. Number two. Yeah. Shorty Snowboards. Dylan, yeah. after his battle that unfortunately he didn't win this time. Wall of Fame, all the church riders up there, Shorty's riders, hardware team, COS logo, church logo, Hellfire, I did all those logos actually, well not that one, but the other ones, Hellfire video, that was the Shorty's catalog that Billy Backer, Jeff Hancock, and myself took over and kind of turned it into a zine. And the gay cowboy reference was because Tony Bulis bought these actual magazines that were gay cowboy magazines, and we had them in the shop mixed in with the freaking skate mags. <laughs> Dodos. Uh, Clay. Mr. Bill was made by Krishna and myself, I think. Yeah, Mashaya Lakalina. I think I've already told you guys before, but maybe you're new on the skateboard stories scene, but Nashaya wrote for BBC uh, brand. Bad Boy Club, but it was like, they for skateboards, they changed the name to um, Better Board Company, I'm pretty sure, something like that. Kind of an obscure brand, but pretty rad, I always thought. Yeah. The Shy is a ripper, dude. And of course, Dylan, too. Ted Ferkwin. Dylan just screwing around, but a tray flip into that bank is pretty gnarly, especially for back then. And that's a patented gnarly heel flip grab that I've never really seen anybody do that except for Dylan, at least on street. So we got a grasshopper missing a leg. Oh, 
poor guy. Missing his leg, dude. La Kalina session with the boys. Come on, you can do it, dude. Go faster. Faster. Wait, you're faster. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Any <laughs> from the coach. <laughs> with the skaters. Dylan, man. It's great nollie flip up the palm stage. 1995. Yeah, Dylan. I still sucked at ollieing up that thing at this time. <laughs> Close. Trying to nollie flip manual. Maybe nose manual, I don't know. George found the grasshopper. <laughs> Sam Marcus. Santa Rosa, and that's Stacy Lowry. Dylan.
Ow. Carl. Back tail. <laughs> Stacy, front tail to forward. Such a good trick on a handrail. Front side, tail side, come out forward. Isla Vista, the air vents. Ted. World famous air vents. Ted. You can see Dylan right there ollieing over it. It's like you end up going straight into the other one. So. See, even Stacy right there had to kind of scoot around the second one. Stacy with this big old pop shove it. Anything over those was gnarly. I think I've talked about that before. That bump sucked. I really don't understand how people skated that. I remember kind of sizing it up, maybe popping a couple ollies off that thing once and just being like, yeah, right, I'm not going to get over this. <laughs> and I just watched an interview with Frankie Hill recently. It was that um, Smitty talking Schmidt. And he was talking about getting clothes in Isla Vista, like free clothes out of the bin. And that's it right behind there. I was filming the bin there for a second. People would just drop off clothes and you could come pick them up right there for low income heads. <laughs> Stacy. Tell me. <laughs> I have to rip a shirt. I will come under you and show you your heart before you die. Well, you want you want a, you want a little bit? Nah, so that's cool. Bit. Next person that walks Somebody by else. <laughs> you want a little bit? No, <laughs> Somebody else. Chest. Oh. Here's your victim. Here's your victim. You'd be dead right now. Here's your victim right there. You're a dead man. You're a dead man. <laughs> <laughs> the Domino's guy. I put my 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 fist in your chest. You will die. That's 40. How long have you been studying? We hear it. I love Vista, man. It's such a fun place to skate and just hang out. Always characters. Always. Bill Backer. This is in Carpinteria. Carp bumps. It's not really there anymore. There's still some things there, but it's not like this. What a fun spot. T2. T2. 
DJ and the guy. Although I don't think he was DJ and the guy yet at this time. Dirty D. Fuck off. Little big brother Starbucks shirt. Pretty sick front tail shove. Don't someone else, man. We was like, I just put the camera on him all the time. He's always like, dude, just film, don't film me. Film someone else. It's like, nope, sorry, dude. <laughs> it's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna film you every time you're near me. Yeah, well, all I can say is I'm glad I did. So that was a pretty simple switch flip over the trash can right there. Stepped off his board, but he still did it. That was like landed on three in a row right there. Four in a row. Booster. <laughs> no. As you can see, we were very far ahead of our time in filmmaking. This is the original follow cam, push cam. And that's, that's a joke, by the way, I'm kidding. This is called dorking around. <laughs> I don't know if I put this in the church video, I can't remember. Seems like I should have. This is hilarious. Ah, oh, George, coming through. <laughs> Still just following him. We're coming to the end of the tape here. A couple more clips. Oh, this is the. This is a no rail and carp. Dylan trying out a front shove it 50-50 or nose grind or something. Gave it a few tries, but that was it. Pretty close getting on it. He probably probably would have been hard to come off of that one because uh, you know he would have landed in the grass. But anyway, that's it for this tape. Thanks for watching everybody. I'll be back soon with another one. Peace.